I was going to say something about, uh, or try to say something about the ordinance that uh, uh, Mr. Walker was going to talk about, and it looks like she's going to put that on the end of the agenda. Can we talk about it now, or wait till we have a turn? Wait, okay. All right, thank you, Mr. Chairman. If I had the privilege to live so long, anyone else could do this? I'm Jack Swift, and I live in Rossier Lane, about 12 miles downstream from here. Uh, I have a question. We're going to be allowed to comment after Commissioner Walker's presentation. This is the only opportunity today to comment. Uh, Did you hear that? It's just the point of order problem. That, uh, how can we talk about or comment on something we haven't heard? Just uh, for the record. I also, I was present. Excuse me, Mr. Swift. I think Mr. Korea was misunderstood what you what you commented to him about. I think he's under the impression that he will be able to comment on the ordinances. But the ordinances. What I heard said. back there too. If I if that was the impression, I apologize. When I went over the agenda first off, and it, it just for everybody to be clear, uh, I thought I was pretty specific about the opportunity for the public to speak if you referred to talk. I think it's on the report. This, that's it. I, I didn't actually make up this agenda. I think it was approved last week when I was out of office. Um, uh, but in, in the board can certainly amend it if they feel that that's important. Um, but at this time, this is the way the agenda is agreed. That should be uh, I, I was observed that the failure to amend and move the comment period to the end would be a great uh, display of pusillanimity. Ooh. I'm not sure about pusillanimity, but I would move that we should have an opportunity to move to make comments after the presentation mm -hmm. on the ordinances. You don't want that. Mike, excuse me. Yeah, uh, Mr. Matthews, for Mr. Now. Matthews, I. I, I appreciate the fact that you have a microphone sitting right with your camera, and your very insightful and learned comments are recorded so that you can replay them on your more than fair presentations on badcounty.com. But that kind of stuff is just inane for me. It's just, it's just so childish, it's pathetic. So if you keep your mouth shut until you are recognized as a speaker, it would be greatly appreciated by such a pusillanimous person like myself. Thank you. 